As you and your family prepare for the cold weather, you may be dusting off that generator just in case the power does go out. But fire officials say if it's not handled properly, it can be deadly. Kennedy Walker's in Fort Worth with some tips to show you how to stay safe. Kennedy. Hey, Karen. Yeah, unfortunately, hundreds of Texans were hospitalized last year because they were exposed to carbon monoxide during last winter storm. This year, the fire department is encouraging everyone to be proactive. They're asking all families to get carbon monoxide alarms and put it on each level of their homes. Carbon monoxide is often referred to as a silent killer because you can't see or smell it. Here's some tips on what not to do with your generators. Never turn on your generators indoors. Keep it away away from doors and windows when it's on and space your generator out at least 20 feet from your home. If your power goes out and you have to use a generator, use that generator well away from your home. Don't leave it next to any open doors. Don't run it in your garage. That uh, carbon monoxide can leak into your home and it can be deadly. The CDC said that approximately 50,000 people nationwide have to be hospitalized because of accidental carbon monoxide poisoning. So, again, they are urging everyone to get those alarms. You can find them at your local hardware store, Karen, at a Home Depot or Lowe's. They run for about $20. Back to you. Right. If you